What is up guys, Johnny here back with more something. It's not Shadowgun Legends, Madfinger Games dropped the bomb today and announced a brand new upcoming game and it's gonna be called Shadowgun War Games. So in today's video, we look at all the information that's available to make you guys understand why they came out with a new game, when is it gonna be released, what exactly it is, and how is it going to affect Shadowgun Legends in the future. So a couple hours ago, they released a Shadowgun War Games trailer on YouTube on Madfinger Games channel. Why are they coming out with another game? Well, originally, War Games was supposed to be part of Shadowgun Legends. As they were working on it, they realized it was going to be way too big for only one game. So they decided to split it into different games. They realized if they were going to go into competitive PvP environment, they had to change their whole approach starting with the maps the maps need to be symmetrical in pvp especially in competitive pvp both teams has to have an equal chance to win and maps should not be a factor in shadowgun legends the maps are not so symmetrical and it's not suited for competitive pvp especially esports then when is it gonna be out not anytime soon not in the next six months they confirmed that the closed beta should be out by the end of the year and the scheduled release date for Shadowgun War Games should be in February 2019 but as you know it is not a fixed date it could be pushed back so we don't know for sure when it's gonna be it could be much later now what is Shadowgun War Games it is a new game it's gonna be capture the flag 5v5 for now probably gonna have more game modes later they said our accounts will be connected between the two games so if you have a Shadowgun Legends account you will be connected with your account on the Shadowgun War Games does that mean you're gonna play War Games with your Shadowgun Legends character no Shadowgun War Games will be like other PvP games. You will select a character at the start of the game. It will be pre-made characters from the Shadowgun universe. So you will play as Willow or Big Red or maybe Slade or Pedro or all the characters that you know. The characters will be fixed. They will have unique set of skills and weapons. So probably different classes depending on the characters. So the characters that you see in the trailer are not the actual characters that you will be playing in Shadowgun War Games. They are still in development. We have a spoiler here, it's Willow. Um, I think she's pretty hot by the way, but it is not a final artwork, it's just in progress right now, but they were able to tease that for now. So you will play Shadowgun characters. When you select a character, it has his own weapons and skills. For now, everything should be free to play, but you will be able to buy skins to customize your characters. The maps will be different from Shadowgun Legends, as I said earlier, they need symmetrical competitive maps. They are talking between one and four maps at the moment. I'm thinking on release there's going to be maybe only one map and that's probably what you're going to see at Gamescom. Don't miss the stream next Saturday. It will be two teams 5v5. It's going to be different from Shadowgun Legends, but it's going to be the same kind of environment. So you won't be able to jump or anything like that. There will still be jump pads. For now, we don't have information on exactly how many different heroes will be available we also don't know if all heroes will be unlocked or if you'll have to work to unlock some of the heroes now they say it's gonna be much more tactical gameplay and teamwork will be important it's not gonna be about the weapons it's gonna be about your ability to shoot to aim to play and work in team now how is it going to affect Shadowgun Legends Shadowgun Legends is not gonna die on the release of war games not at all some questions came out what's gonna happen to the pvp in shadowgun legends well first of all pvp is not gonna go it's still gonna be there but it's still gonna be more casual pvp it's not competitive it's just for fun next question i saw is is shadowgun legends gonna be only having pve content now not at all they said they want to keep both pve and pvp in shadowgun legends and they are still going to bring more content in the future but what they said is we want shadowgun legends to bring more co-op and PvE experience. And we already know about the upcoming content in Shadowgun Legends and it was pretty much all PvE. 
after the new game mode that just released we knew already the next content updates were gonna be pve we've been hearing a lot about unlocking the next planet uh, the next skill points and new arena new dungeons into the game even the upcoming events we already knew we're gonna have some pve events like pedro dorado so it's not that the game will be split in pve and pvp different games shadow gun legends still gonna be having both but what i'm thinking is when war games gonna come out the serious pvp players will probably leave for this new game and the serious pve players they already don't play much pvp anyways so i don't think that the player base of shadow gun legends will all move to the new game the pve guys will keep playing shadow gun legends the pvp guys will probably move to shadow gun war games but some guys like bolt they will play both you don't have to play one or the other you know but what they said about shadow gun legends is when the game first came out it was all about working on the player experience make sure everything runs good and once the bugs are fixed and the game runs smoothly now they can start adding end game content and this is what's going to happen now that's what we know for now shadow gun war games is another game it's coming not anytime soon at least six months it's not gonna affect Shadow Gun Legends that much. It's not gonna separate PvP from PvE. And they're not gonna stop adding new content in Shadow Gun Legends. That's all I have for today. If you have any questions or if I forgot something, post your questions below, post your comments below what you think about that. And I'll try to come up with an update soon, trying to answer most of your questions. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like, subscribe to the channel. I'll be back soon, take care. Thank you.